In this example, I'm gonna work on a PDF assignment that my teacher assigned to me called PDF Example Storyboard. So I click on it and it's actually an assignment and the teacher has included a link to the file for me here. So I click on the PDF so that it loads up and it actually brings this file up in a new tab. One thing that's great about iPads is I have the share button over here whenever you see that rectangle with the arrow pointing up, it's called share. And notice that I can say markup. And markup moves it to this screen, which gives me some tools like a pencil, marker, highlighter, th eraser, and different colors that I can use to actually illustrate right on top of my drawing. So there we go. And of course, there's some other tools that you can uh, to use as well. Notice I clicked on the plus sign to get to text and some shapes and things like that. Now, when I'm finished with this, I'm gonna click share in the top right again. And I wanna save this to my iPad. So you have the option that says save to files. I pressed save to files right now. And at this po point, I can click save to save it onto my iPad. All right, now I will click done in the top left over here. And I can delete this PDF, I don't need it anymore. The one I needed is saved and I can close this out and go back to Canvas. Now this is an assignment that my teacher is asking me to upload something, it's a file upload assignment. So I will press submit and down here where it says choose file, I will click choose file and I'm not going to take a picture and I'm not going to grab a picture from my photo library. I'm going to browse because the file is saved on my iPad. As you can see, there's my storyboard. Click that to attach the file, press submit. And I've just submitted my assignment as a edited annotated PDF. Now, if you ever have questions about if you submitted it, you can see here it says submitted August 28th to 12 p.m.